and the youngest heart can explore and laugh and play together here when magical makes you around every corner thirsty with joy and inspiration to make your dreams come true and to officially welcome you the one the only Nikki Mouse <laughs> Good morning, morning everybody. I hope you're all doing really, really well. Today is the 22nd of September. Yep, I've got that right. And it's day six of our holiday. We're back in Magic Kingdom today for more interactions and a few bits of rides too. We've done the extra hours today. So that meant we got to ride on two rides, which was Winnie the Pooh and, oh, what was it? Oh, I, I keep forgetting. Okay, but I know it, it was two. And then we met at Character Interactions, which was the Tremaine Sisters. And so we've done pretty much everything except for walking in the, the park that is. Oh, and we just saw the opening show as well. So we get to watch the park being open to the public, which is fantastic and um, really exciting. So we're going to continue our way to meet Mary today for the second time because I heard she is in Magic Kingdom as well as in Epcot. And then we're going to try and possibly meet the fairy godmother today. And so we're just going to have to see how we go. But well, bear in mind, it may be a bit hot today, but so far it's been very cool. So we may be lucky, we may be not, but you could just never tell these things. I'm waiting in line for a certain special someone. I cannot tell you who it is though, because it's a secret. But all I know is I'm going to make someone extremely jealous. So, if you know who you are, I'm sorry. I really am sorry. But I'm going to have to do this. It's going to be official. Well, hello there. Uh, hello, Gaston. You know, this might not be your birthday, but coming to see me is the best decision you've made all year. Oh, no, I didn't mean to I know this is going to be Will you be my boyfriend? Oh, I like the way you are. It's just one problem. It's already set out the wedding on the day. Oh, no! This is scary. Oh, no. I'm so heartbroken. I know. Tell you what, I can leave you with a way that they can leave all day long. Oh, you are such a guy. I absolutely am, but it's always good to hear it from someone else. Tell you what. I think we can also take some because it'll make all those sad feelings go away. Let me let her get in there first. Oh, it absolutely was. It was a pleasure to see you as well. But of course. Well, we can always use the prize. I'm sure you could join some of those silly girls in the I have a wedding. Love that. Absolutely! You'll have so much to bond over. Oh. <laughs> Until we meet again. And we meet again. Well, Gaston turned me down. He rejected me. No! But it was lovely seeing him though. Though, I have to admit, he may or may not just hang out with the girls when he gets married to Belle. If Belle accepts him, of course. But even if I don't guess on, there's always Luke Evans. There'll always be Luke Evans. Tremains. And um, on the third time, I know I didn't record this because I know 
probably may or may not be bored, but I'm going to tell you anyway, because this is what Anastasia told me. If you've seen the sequel, Dreams Come True, then you'll know that Anastasia has a very huge love relationship with the baker. And according to her, she said that they always have their rendezvous at midnight, and Drizella found out and she went, oh, I'm telling mother. But I asked her what the name of the baker was, because this is the age-old question. What was the name of the baker? In response, Anastasia said, Oh, well, I cannot tell you. It's as secret as his little pies. So I think that's going to be a huge secret from now on. I'm, I'm kind of okay with it, really, because I wanted to know what the name was. But if it's a secret, then it's best kept that way. Cinderella. Oh, hello, Your Majesty. You must be the little mermaid of this family. Oh, yes. I am. I must say, I think you like to forget that for the best of us all. Oh, yes. I think you've made the best choice for today. Oh, okay. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I still cannot believe I've done it. I mean, I just really can't believe it. Um, this is going to be a little bit emotional because after doing it, I was very moved by my own actions. Uh, I, I know I shouldn't be really doing that, but that's going to be the main thing. There is this very special friend who always comments on my videos and his name is Brian and every time he comments on my videos he has an obsession and well not it's sort of an obsession but he adores Cinderella which was which is his favourite character of all and he always tells me that he wish that he can go to Disney World and to curtsy with her but living very far away and worries that he will get judged for doing that he said to me at one point he didn't really have the desire to do it and he felt like it's just a dream and that's going to be the end of it. But when I came here I thought I should help make his dream come true and that's just what I did. So Brian if you are watching this right now this is for you and I hope I made your dreams come true. To play guitar and don't tell him that I said this but he's the best guitar player that I know. So I practice every day and I think I'm catching up to him. Oh I think you bet practice better than mine. <laughs>
So that was really interesting. We did Enchanted Tales with Belle and oh my goodness, I absolutely loved it. Belle included the children to be part of the story. So this setting happens during the film Beauty and the Beast, but Belle is getting ready for her dance at the hall. So everyone gets to tell their story in their own different parts from the actual beginning where Belle leaves the castle all the way up until the ball scene and it's really lovely how they've done it out and let the audience enjoy it really to be honest i'm going to leave the vlog here because magic kingdom's going to be closing very soon and even though we've been here since eight o'clock this morning it has been a really long day so tomorrow i'm not sure if i'm going to be vlogging or not because we are going to animal kingdom but there's going to be one place that we're going to go and it's going to get really really wet so i'm going to have a bit of debate whether to bring my camera or not or just call it a day off um, tomorrow but on sunday i will definitely do an evening vlog for the not so scary halloween party so if you did enjoy this vlog today, please like, comment and subscribe as always. And until then, I'll catch you either tomorrow or Sunday. Or just basically, I'll catch you this weekend. Bye!